My name is Marcus Dill. I'm a managing director, one of the founders and owners of Mayato, a consulting company uh, from Germany and uh, Austria, uh, specialized in business intelligence and analytics. Um, well, we have about 80 employees um, spread across uh, Central Europe and we're doing projects across uh, Europe basically, actually worldwide with a focus on Central Europe. Um, the headquarters of our company, Mayato, is here in Berlin. Um, we founded the company 10 years ago um, and, uh, well, three founders, one of them lived in Berlin, so we decided to go for Berlin. Uh, that is an attractive place uh, with many young people, uh, many brilliant young si data scientists and this is actually one of the core topics uh, for our company. We're doing a lot of analysis uh, projects and this is what we do for our customers. We do customer analytics, we do uh, industry analytics, financial analytics, whatever data customers have, we analyze it for them with uh, algorithms, with intelligent um, mathematics and um, we provide for our customers uh, the uh, data science know-how, but also the IT know-how to integrate data, to um, well, build up data warehouses and reporting solutions required in addition to uh, these uh, analytics um, solutions. Um, yeah, analytics is, I think it's, um, Today a must. Uh, it's state of the art. Um, in all industries today, um, the deciders notice that um, the game has changed over the last years. In nearly every industry, there's an Amazon, a Google, an Apple, some, some competitor that is coming from, from the side uh, that was never there in the past. And companies that uh, didn't change their business over, over decades now notice uh, they have to change. They have to change now. And analytics is key to all these things like Internet of Things, like digitalization, um, all these uh, buzzwords uh, in, 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 the, in various industries um, have behind them actually analytics as, as a key uh, skill that is required and as a key uh, process that is required. The, the better you know uh, when exactly um, a machine will break or some part will break, um, the, the more precise you can uh, plan your resources. Uh, you can plan downtimes uh, more precisely. In many cases, companies, industry companies, have to uh, plan a lot of buffer in their um, maintenance schedules. Uh, so they, uh, they try to, to replace uh, relatively frequency spare part, uh, frequently spare parts, even though it would not be required actually, but they, since, since they don't know when exactly uh, the machine will fail, um, well, they, they have to be on the safe side. Um, if uh, we can predict this much smarter, then it's easier for them to, uh, well, to shift this uh, time when, uh, uh, when, when a spare part is needed uh, to a later uh, period. Um, yeah, for, for our clients, we are always looking for the best technologies that they might be interested in or that, they, that feeds uh, or that, that uh, fulfills their requirements best. And um, among the databases, the analytical databases, we consider Exosol as uh, the best choice. Uh, we have made uh, very good experiences with Exosol over the last years uh, in many of our consulting projects. Uh, we built up for our clients several solutions um, on top of Exosol and we like very much that uh, there's, well, th th it doesn't create much work to work with Exosol. You can focus on the solution, on the business case that you want to solve um, and there's no, no much worrying about uh, maintenance of the database. Uh, modeling is easy, uh, work with the database is easy, performance is great. So Exosol has many, many advantages for us. Uh, that's why we like to work with Exosol in our projects and recommend our customers to use Exosol um, if they are uh, asking us uh, for the appropriate technology for them. I like this company. Um, I, I liked it from the beginning. Uh, I liked working with uh, the people there. Um, and it's not just me that like these people, but also my customers that like these people. They like the way that Exosol treats them. Uh, they are not just one of um, hundreds of uh, customers or thousands of customers. 
Um, if they have a complaint or if they have an issue, which hardly ever is the case, but if anything is happening, if, anything, if any help is needed by Exosol, this help is coming quickly, it's coming very effectively, um, and so it's, it's a lot of fun to work with Exosol as a partner, but also as a customer.